five non-lubricated mini balls. I'm going to be lubricating them in a mixture of tallow and beeswax. You can see the uh, rings around the mini balls and these of course were filled in with the uh, lubricating mixture. Over just my kitchen stove I'm uh, heating up the beeswax and tallow mixture. In just a few minutes it'll have completely liquefied uh, once it's done so, I can start uh, dipping the bullets into the beeswax uh, several times and letting them cool in between each application. What I'll be using, this is a fairly low tech, just a little piece of wood. I've drilled some holes through there, just of the diameter of the mini ball. I'll run the mini balls after they've been lubed through the, si through the sizers, or what I use for a sizer, and that'll uh, trim off the excess. All the equipment assembled, it's time to start lubricating the mini balls. Simply dip the mini ball up to the uh, lubrication rings a few times. It just takes a few seconds for the wax, wax to dry. I'll leave it sit probably about a full minute to let it fully cool before taking off the excess. The next step will simply to run it through a sizer that I mentioned earlier. Uh, one thing that's uh, interesting to notice, I've noticed especially while shooting the Manet balls in the winter time, especially when it gets you know closer to uh, 5 or 10 above or even closer to 0, what once was very malleable wax now becomes pretty hard to having trouble getting a Manet ball down the barrel. So our next step will simply be to run this through. You can see the excess has been pushed off and we've just got some lube in the lubrication rings. Let me do this to a couple more. And I don't worry too much about a little uh, extra wax. The extra wax that will just accumulate around here, beeswax, I'll just simply throw back into the, the pot so to speak. And taking the excess wax off the mini balls, just took another minute or so. I'll let these cool, and of course the next step in our loading process will be to uh, take these mini balls and make cartridges.